This is the most powerful sexual technique. With this sexual technique, you will make her feel amazing in every moment of sex. You will turn her on like never before. You will really awaken all of her sexual energies to the maximum. You will give her the most amazing sexual feelings and you will make her ultimately orgasmic in her most advanced orgasmic states. And you use this most powerful sexual technique in every moment of sex, in every part of sex, in the foreplay, in the arousal, in the oral, in the intercourse. I'm Alexei Welsh and I've been working with women for the last 20 years as a sex coach and a sex therapist. And this most powerful sexual technique comes from my direct observation of how the female sexual system works. So one thing that I've learned from women over the years is that uh, women often find sex with guys annoying. They find it annoying how guys are treating their body, how guys are stimulating their body. And the annoying part is always that guys are doing something too fast. The actual speed of movement of your touch, of your stimulation, of everything is too fast. Guys are often uh, moving all over her body, trying to be passionate really, really fast. Uh, they're stimulating things always really fast. They're moving in the intercourse really fast. And this often does not do anything for her. It does not give her more pleasure. It shuts her down. It makes her feel nothing. And often it even irritates her. There's a physical irritation from having her body treated like this. So there is a mathematical error here that guys are making. They think the more you're moving, the faster you're moving, the more she's getting. No, she is getting more when you're transmitting more sexual energy, when you're transmitting more sexual feeling to her in this moment. This is when she's getting more out of sex. This is not about how much you're moving. You might not be moving almost at all. You could put your hand on her and she will vibrate with turn on and sexual energy. If you do it right, you don't make her feel more by moving faster. You make her feel more by moving slower with more feeling. Her body feels a lot more when you're moving slower. When you're moving slower, you're creating a lot more sexual feeling. She feels a lot more sensation when you're moving slower. But this isn't all just about the physical sensation. When you're moving slower, she can feel more in general in this moment. She can feel more you, your presence, your love, your connection, your desire that you're sending into her. She can feel it all a lot more when you're moving slower. She can read into it, she's not rushed. And then this becomes much more powerful sexual energy for her in the moment. So there is one most powerful sexual technique that you can use to really engage the most powerful sexual energy for her in this moment, whatever you are doing. And that technique is go slow, but with intense desire. Really slow down, move slowly. Uh, whatever you're doing. Now, what might you be doing in sex? Well, let's make a list. You might be touching her body. You might be kissing her body. You might be holding her body. You might be moving on her body. You might be uh, touching her clitoris. You might be touching her inside the vagina. You might be giving her oral. You might be moving in the intercourse, right? These are the things that you will typically do. More or less, that's the full list. All of those things really slow down, feel into this moment, go more slowly, but with a really intense desire and you will magnify sexual energy in all of those things in every moment. So let me take you through this step by step. First of all, stop trying to make her calm. You are not going to make her calm by being really hectic and really, you know, trying to rub really hard. You are not going to make her calm. When you're really busy like this and just stimulating her really hard, you're only going to shut down her feelings. You're going to put her under pressure. It's going to be totally counterproductive. If she's ever going to come with you, it's only if you really take your time, build up slowly uh, that sexual energy in her, take her to that peak of sensitivity, and then maybe you can speed up and do some stronger movement. But if you start from that in the beginning, that's only going to shut her down. So forget about that. Take a deep breath. You are not in a hurry. She does not want it to be over quickly. You do not need to do this. She wants it to be long. Take a deep breath that you have all the time in the world now to enjoy her body little by little, step by step, in every place. You just really want to enjoy her body. And then when you're touching her body, slow down your movement, but really feel how amazing her body feels, how beautiful it feels to you, how sexy it is. And really send from yourself really intense desire. Make her feel how much 
you are desiring her right now, how amazing she feels. Send it from your body. Now, this is the important part. Just going slower by itself doesn't do anything. You know, this might feel a bit lethargic, a bit like you're going through the motions again. No, going slower on its own doesn't do anything. Going slower so that in that slowness, you can send her really intense desire, really intense feeling how sexy she is. That is what she wants to feel from you. That is what will really engage her, that intense desire that you are sending when you're moving slower. You are moving over her body. Slow down, don't be hectic. Move over her body slowly, but really desire her. Send that intense desire into her. You are going to stimulate her clitoris or her vagina. Really slow down, don't be hectic. Make movements that are very slow, but really send that electric sexual desire into her from your fingers. Really connect there with her. Really tell her how much you want her with your fingers. You're going down on her, doing oral. Really slow down. Don't do a lot of movement. Really slow down. Make very slow movements, but really love how she feels there and send a lot of desire into her there really make her feel like you really want her and she is so sexy. You're moving in the intercourse. Slow down your movement, but move with intense desire. Really enjoy how she feels. Enjoy how sexy she feels and transmit to her that feeling that you really love how sexy she feels and you really desire her right now. And you know something you can even try? Just completely be in stillness for a moment with your hands or with your body or inside her and just in that stillness, transmit really intense desire, how you really want her to feel your desire. You will be surprised how much sexual energy she feels from that. As an example of this on oral sex, download my free course below this video in the description, follow that link. It will show you the exact sequence, how you're using this technique of going much slower but with intense feeling. That will give you a bit more of an idea and you need to be doing everything like that in sex to maximize her sexual energy. And look, it is not difficult. It is not a complicated technique. Just stop trying to do something really anxiously, trying to get some kind of a result. Just really enjoy her body right now. You love her body, right? It is sexy to you. Just really sink into that. Really enjoy the energy of her body, the sexiness of her body, and just transmit to her that feeling, how much you're enjoying it, and slow down. That is all. It's really not difficult. But you will see how from that she will feel a lot more than if you're doing too much. She will get turned on a lot more. She will be vibrating with that sexual energy a lot more. So just relax. Calm down. You've got nowhere to be. You don't need to hurry anywhere. You don't need to achieve anything. This is what she wants. You going slower with all the time in the world without rushing anywhere, just feeling and enjoying every moment. This is what she wants from you. That's it, guys. Enjoy this. And another topic that is very related to this, that I want you to understand, is why lasting longer in the intercourse does not make you a better lover and you need to do something completely different. So go and check out that video that I have on that topic.